It will be a more challenging Vulgen game. No Hydra. But I don't think we take Brucon, Kurtis, or Mukla instead of a Vulgen. It's not about winning, it's about sending a That's a nice start. That's such a good minion to switch. It's probably going to be dragons with Nadina later and put Divine Shield on the high damage. It's so tempting, it's a lot of good minions, but without money it just doesn't work. Risen Rider Amalgam. Yeah, double Eternal Knight on Vulgin is also really sweet. The strongest move is Eternal Knight Skull. I don't think I want to be a lot weaker than I can be, so I'm going to just play for tempo here. If you can get stronger, it's probably a good idea to get stronger. You want it to be alive so the skull can buff it, otherwise you take damage if you lose the round. Yeah, Looks like we still lose the round because I have a good board, but... Uh, actually, we could tie. 50-50 for a tie. Unfortunately. So that, that's just what I said here, right? You don't want to be weaker than you can be. Making it a 4-2 would mean we take more damage here. Oh. It's a Pog Champ game, chat. This goes to the 2-2 pretty much every time. Yeah, double Eternal Knight is very good on Vol'jin because you can take the stats from the Knight and it will get it right back after the fight. Oh, is it even after the fight? Yeah, it's after the fight right now. Because my guy was a 2-2 now. Yeah, so that's the issue. This one didn't die now, but if we don't buff with the skull, we might lose, so... You won. Congratulations. The knob up to <laughs> Out of five. Keep it real. Alright, uh, tone it down a little, Jig. It's not that kind of chat. Swapping knights seems like good scaling once the knights have a few stacks. Yeah, if they're both big, I guess, yeah, it's true. It I mean, it I'll do what I can. Hey, I said no refund. Let the corruption spread. I'm 32, uh, Makurai. I don't like banning people, but yeah. Some people just like to be banned, so yeah. I guess give them what they want. Yeah, arm is a good way to farm attack for our buddy. I guess if I put my buddy on a knight, 
It then gets rebuffed, right? We're pretty confident here. I think we just go Pen Pelia. So I put the 15 to the Gadrin, and then the Gadrin rebuffs here, and then this gets the Eternal Knight stacks back, and then I move it to the Gadrin again. I mean, this happens for sure. Right? And then you can argue, move this somewhere else. So maybe I go to 5 and try to get Glow Scale, try to get Blanche. Cyborg Drake is also really good. That's my favorite hero. Vol'jin is definitely one of my favorites. Right now I think it's ETC because it's so strong. It's really fun to play. It's super imbalanced, of course. But still very fun to play. <laughs> yeah, our high damage is countering their hero power a bit. Hey, Noel. Thank you for the 40. Welcome back. Great to have you. Nice. Not taking damage here is good. That makes it more likely that we can go to tier 5 for all those good cards. And because we saved the pen pal, we have a bit of extra money and we can get the golden buddy faster. I do like leveling, so I will do that for sure. Could make the arm deal a lot of damage here. But maybe I just make the 2-7 deal a lot of damage. Let's see, I'm doing this. I still put it here. Yeah, I'll just do it like this. Make the 2-7 deal damage this turn. Maybe even move it up a bit more, right? Gathering doesn't have to be next to it anymore. It's just better for combat overall, I'd say. This is a complicated spot to navigate, but there's obviously tons of potential here. We just need to get the good cards now. It's so likely going to be a dragon endgame because Nadina is going to be so good for us. If we find the triple eternal knight, it's also huge. Why do you not buff the bigger one? I want to have two taunts. The glow scale is super good. Let's see if I roll the Blanche. Ah, this is too late to be good now. I don't want more taunt either, I'm fine. That's a lot of attack. I don't want to work with this. This is almost always out. Nice. This is good, chat. This is good. I guess I sell out of this. I think I still want double taunts for the arm. I don't think I need another arm. I do want another glow skill. I hope you win. It will be good for my franchise. Low scale and up. It's very possible. I can also make my golden buddy this turn. And then I can make both the glow scales deal shit ton of damage, but we will see. Test died. That's good news. Alright, so I have 41 damage here now. Then I can make both close scales. Mainly Greta. Okay. I should have swapped first, right? I should have swapped first. Well, maybe, maybe. Summoner, Manted, Kelly. So good here, yeah. So I can take the Eternal Knight stats and put it on the Summoner. That's probably better. And then rebuff this guy. And then buff this. 
I'm gonna change the positioning a bit here. And now we are going to get very strong. And then this can get sold. Yeah, that's good. Whew. That's some cool shit we are doing here. How does the uh, hero power work with Eternal Knight? You yoink the stats and you get it back the turn after. It's very good. I buffed the summoner's HP. It might grief me for scaling, but... If my biggest problem is that I'm never losing fights, that's honestly a pretty good problem to have. I will have that problem all the way to first place. No pro no, no worries. <laughs> that's a quality problem to have. Okay. I could play the Anubarak here. Oh. Maybe I just hold this. No, I can rebuff for it. I think I'm fine with that. This one is mine. So I'll swap the knights and see what happens. They should regain it next turn. I guess I don't want this to survive, so I'll just buff the sun, the gathering. Oh, I should move this up one, right? Ah, it's weird though with the positioning. Ah, oh, the positioning is so weird. <laughs> they have a big Chronormo, so... Oh, and they have two Mantids. Yeah, we should definitely be fine. It's funny, I'm rooting for them to be strong enough, so I get my value. <laughs> That's so funny. Yes, get me my value. Get me my value. <laughs> oh, they still died. They have such a strong board, but they're dead. Pick L. All right. Finally, a worthy challenger. My eternal knights died. Oh! I like that. More Blanche, more Summoner, and we're kind of done. I can move it to a Summoner. Oh, that's actually still really good. And then it regains it next turn. Do I care about Leroy? I should bank it, I guess. Play it instead of a Nubarak if I don't hit. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that's good. That's a large boy right there. And then the Gadarin will rebuff this, and we just don't run this. The shield always goes on the horse. More shields, more better. Hmm, Golden Brand, but they must not have had it for a long time, because their stuff is really small. This is such a sweet Vol'jin game, man. Oh. Ignore the quest guide thing. That's not up, that's not up to date, but it is a link to the YouTube. i to check it out. I need to tr switch that command out. Let's just find the Eternal Knight. Big Titus at some point. I'm not gonna sell anything here, right? I just cycle the Greta. I could cycle the Leroy here to bank the Titus. That's not bad. Or I could just cycle the Glow Scale if I want to be really safe. But he's showing undead. Having the glow scale for next turn is good, right? Yeah. 
Two best targets. Yeah, really nice. Right, they have a lot of damage, but not a lot of tokens. 212 HP Kronormu. Is that a problem, chat? They do deal a lot of damage. It's gonna come down to uh, getting more summoner, I guess. They have Ice Block. They do have Ice Block. Alright, we do pop the block. That's nice. They did get scaling in this turn, but we are scaling more than they could. I guess I can also get out of an Eternal Knight this turn if I don't hit. That's not that good for me. I need Horse or Summoner. Oh, I'm not gonna make that even bigger. Fuck that. Alright, no, we're gonna swap off this this turn. This could be Summoner. Could swap it to the Summoner. Nadina, 40 seconds. Fell Stomp or Orgo. Probably Orgo. I can always play the Titus if I need a minion. Nice. So Orgo is out. This is out. We cycle this. We play these two. Make this huge. Put this here. Put this here. Roll a bit. Oh, uh, it was a horse. Well, I don't have more shields. Horse is actually not that good anymore. I like this being big just so I can trade their shit properly. Oh, I guess I need to shield that thing, right? Honestly, maybe the Titus is uh, not even that good here. Yeah, they're gonna be alive. That's fine, they've stopped scaling. We got our huge Divine Shield. Oh, he left? 